What's good YouTube? It's your boy Dynamite back at again with the video. In today's video, we got a review on the Everlast Hyperflex Strike Reflex Bag. And let's get right into the video. So as you can see, I'm just warming up my body, you know, doing shadow boxing. I like to do this because, you know, warming up is actually good for your body and it prevents from injuries as well. I'm not going to show you how to put it all together because it's just pretty simple. Yeah, it's three steps. Even a oh kick can do it. But what I would tell you guys, it has three different ways to use it. So basically, w one is to, to go faster, two is to go slower, or three is like both. But I'm gonna show you right now how to use it and use it in many ways for boxing and styles like practicing your defense and your offense. If you guys are looking to buy this equipment, I'll put the link down in the description below so you guys can check it out from there and see if you want to buy it or not. So the first thing you can do, you know, is basically, you know, slip and slide. You can throw a jab and then block it like I'm doing right now. Just keep jabbing. You can also do double jab, you know, just like this, then block it. You can also focus on your right. So basically throw one, two. So throw a jab and then a two. One thing that I forgot to tell you guys is that I got this bag about eight months ago. So that's when you don't see the logo and on top of that I use it every day. Another technique you can focus on is your lead hook which is your left hand. So fit your opponent then throw the lead hook. Then you can just catch and do it all over again. You can throw your rear hook which is your right hook. Just throw that one which is a jab and then throw the right hook or you can do a uppercut both hands don't matter as long as you don't get caught by your opponent and it should be good if you guys have this just for fun you know you can just focus on throwing that jab and then right just do one then two one two you can switch it up you know you can throw a right hook or uppercut Another way you guys can use this is by using your, your feet. You can just lift up your legs. It's like doing cardio at the same time. But remember guys, footwork is king. So that's the most important thing you, you can do. Like Muhammad Ali says, stink like a bee and fly like a butterfly. Also, you can do is lift up your arms like I'm doing right now, which is way harder than it looks guys. Trust me when I say this. You can go and try it for yourself if you have this bag. I think I did this like about eight times, so it's kind of dizzy afterwards, but so far it's actually good if you just want to sweat and just burn some calories. This is not a professional bag, but it doesn't mean that it's bad. It does the job, so I'm fine with that. And you can work in many ways, like I'm telling you right now. For example, as you see in this clip, you can dodge, you know, you can dodge the bag. Just make sure if you are using this, wear a mouth guard so that way if you do get caught by the bag, you have protection and you know your teeth won't fall. Once again guys, I'll put the link down in the description below so you guys can check it there. So don't worry. Like I was saying guys, you can just throw your right or your jab and then dodge the bag like when it's coming at you. Like you saw right there. You can also do this, which is a good way of doing cardio in my opinion because you know you have your hand up which is your right and then you throw in your jab at the same time which is also good and on top of that you're working on your foot and like I said before footwork is king if you guys are punching this bag really hard just be careful not to get hit back because in this clip <laughs> I got hit in the head but it didn't really hurt but anyways guys let's just move to the other way how to use this you could just throw simple punches, you know, left to right, left to right until you get tired. I do this about five minutes of uh, 10 rounds. So I, I don't know how much uh, minutes are those, but yeah. You can also focus on throwing your jabs, you know, your right, your uppercut, your hook, like I was mentioning before, you know. Just one thing that I dislike about this it's product, uh, this bag, I mean, is that it's really slow when you throw your jabs, for example, here, you know. I wanted to, you know, dodge it, but too slow for me. So I just kept, you know, punching the bag. That is it for today's video, guys. Thanks for watching again. And remember, guys, to be positive and positive things will happen. Peace.